What's up guys, it's Recon, and I'm back with another video. In this video I'll be talking to you about uh, Installation 01, which is a fan-made Halo game, uh, bringing back the feel of the Bungie era Halo games. Honestly, they were my thing, they were so good. The game uses the Unity engine, which is, um, it's used quite a few games, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, quite, quite a few game developers use it. Firstly, we're going to get into the, the environment of the of the game. The concept art for the maps looks fantastic, honestly. I cannot wait to delve into those maps to see what I can get up to. Secondly, we have the weapons. As we can see, we can, we have the SMGs, the Covenant Carbine, the Tripod Launcher from Halo 3. Anyone that played Valhalla on Halo 3 would pick that up as soon as they spawned, go through the grav lift, and oh, they would wreak havoc on people. Honestly, it was so good. We also see the plasma rifle. That's making a return. As we see in Halo 5, a 343 cut it out in favour of the storm rifle, which is a more linear and less confusing gun because they try to appeal to a younger audience. Blah, blah, blah. Next up, we have the vehicles. We can see the Ghost, the Scorpions. They're like two iconic vehicles in the Halo universe. And we have a variation of the elephant, that'd be my guess. It's in the top left corner of the pictures. It looks like a big, like, a transporter vehicle. That, my, my guess would it, it'd, be an it'd be an elephant. Like, honestly, like, what else would it be? Last, we have the armor. In Installation 01, I think they've revealed Mark V, Mark VI, CQB, Security Police? I don't know if they put that in there. And Recon. I, I know they've got Recon because when I signed up for their site to have them have an account. Oh god, the challenges for Recons. I, I can't remember off the top of my head, but they were so hard. I'm pretty sure one of them was to get a kill while teabagging someone you just killed. Like, oh god, that, that'd be brilliant. People are going to be grinding so long for that. Oh god, the bit in the trailer that excited me the most with the return of the Elite. If you played Halo 4 or Halo 5, you'd know that flipping 343 fucking took elites out of the game. I have no idea why. I think maybe because competitive play since they got that Halo 5. Elites had different hitboxes, but like people would use it as you can like get snipes to their head like from behind them. I think that's a reason people use them in competitive. I don't know, but they removed them. They haven't been in since Halo Halo Reach, the last game you were allowed to play them in. Uh, I don't know. Installation 01 looks brilliant. Honestly, just watching videos makes me feel like a child again playing Halo 3 multiplayer. I'm oh, so excited. I'm pretty sure it's going to be downloaded through Steam or... Uh, probably Steam. I, I That's my best guess. Um, I'll be getting a PC for my birthday. I think it'll be a £700 gaming PC as a budget build to start off with. And yeah, I'll play it with my viewers, if there's anyone watching, for Halo. And I'll be playing it with my mates, and I'll, just, I'll, I'll cover Installation 01. Looks like a fantastic game. Oh, and I'll also, I'll also start bringing you Project Contingency news. That's another fan-made Halo game. I'll tell you more about that another time. But anyway, um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.